everyone! Welcome back to Moto's Money. Today I am, uh, oh, my name is Lacey and on this channel we talk about cash stuffing, budgeting, sinking funds, paying down my mortgage, and savings challenges chiefly. Um, today I have my um, cash stuffing for my sinking funds for the second paycheck of October 2022. So let us go into my spreadsheet first and see what we're planning to do with this money. Okay, let's start at the top here. For my 1015 paycheck, I am going to be, uh, first of all, have $508 total that we're stuffing as far as the sinking funds go today. I have a little bit more that we're going to be stuffing into our Halloween challenge um, that's not included in this. I believe it's um, $105. And then, up at the top here we have our emergency fund which is our 100 envelope challenge box in the next video we'll be getting $350 a significant rise from our $205 last time so yay trip oh, new car we'll be getting 10 Orlando trip 5 welcome talent 1 mortgage 30 new fridge we wanted to make that a big priority coming few months and so it's actually getting 50 Christmas isn't getting anything um, our investment property is getting five. We finished that challenge that we were doing, the $1,000 savings challenge, or at least we finished what we were going to use of it, which was around $800, and I had a little bit of extra money left that we're actually going to also be stuffing today, which I included in these numbers, so yay. Washer dryer is getting one, bedroom furniture one, home security. So, funny story about home security, um, someone tried to break into our house um, the other night. It was extremely scary. Um, yeah, we just heard this rattling, and we're like, what is that? And then the rattling got, like, a lot more forceful at our door. Excuse me, so we bought some cameras, and I went to pay myself back for this. So, uh, no one broke in. The door actually wasn't even damaged. We scared them off because we turned on the light, so. But anyways, um, veterinary is also getting five, so there's that. Let's go down to the bottom. Um, we'll go through the total as we go. The 1910 was money that came out of the emergency fund to pay for the security cameras which is why there's a discrepancy there is $120. Uh, we got blank security cameras, so um, we like them a lot so far. They're motion detected, and um, they will alert you on your phone. I think it's $3 a month per camera for a subscription to that service to be able to save the videos and access them on your phone. So I highly recommend this. Amazon is having sales on them for Prime Day is when we got them in the two-pack, but yeah, they sell a lot more products than just the cameras as well so you might look into that if you're looking for that kind of a situation mm -hmm. then of note on here is christmas we spent a bunch of money and got a bunch of christmas gifts on prime day for my niece and nephew so yay and then i'm home security this 100 dollars at the end of the month i plan to take it out and to pay it back into my emergency fund so yay at the very bottom here i have halloween money <laughs> that we have been spending from the challenge that i also need to reimburse myself for so far we've spent money at spirit halloween and amazon for halloween we're gonna have a little get together so 103 dollars there so yeah there's my paper update let me zoom back out so i'm gonna bring my binder back over here and let's open this up on top here i have this thousand dollar challenge that i actually am done with uh, i need to clean it off so i'm just gonna put it back in my drawer and this was the envelope with all the money that we had left that we haven't spent. So let's take this out and put it in our piles up here. Got two tens, two fives, and five ones going up here oh you guys guess what I got it's so quick <laughs> I don't know if you've ever seen um, Alicia from hands and bands but she has little infomercials every time she gets her sort quick out I'm talking about how it's hygienic and long-lasting and the easy clean way to get a better grip I think that's hilarious but I want I was like hmm is this for real like is this useful and I was like okay so yes it is actually super useful um, you're supposed to just get a little bit on your fingers and like rub it in. I, I had never used it before. I've never like worked at a bank or worked with handling a lot of money. So I was like, huh, okay, this would be super useful like in an office too if you have to handle like a lot of papers. 
because I have trouble um, keeping the money and not like slipping it out of my fingers. So we'll see. We'll do that today and see how it goes. All right, let's go down the list here. First of all, we are going to start with our new car fund. It's getting $10 today. Okay, let's count it up. We have 50, 150, 250, 350, 400, 450, 460, 470, 480. $480. And I have my little tracker. Alas, until we get to 680, we cannot color in a car. Wah, wah, wah. Today, I know it says 1015 um, on my spreadsheet, but it's actually the 18th when I'm filming this on the Tuesday. The 15th fell on a weekend, and we got back from our trip on that day also. So, uh, we went to go see a cave system. It was super fun. Went and did a little hiking. Did a little exploration of nature. I like to do that kind of thing. Speaking of vacations, now we have our Orlando trip fund, yay! <laughs> and it's going to be getting five dollars. Oh, and I also have my um, coloring tracker for this that I made. I need to pull out. One second. Okay, each of the shapes on here is two hundred and forty dollars, and we only currently have two hundred sixty-nine dollars in there. So I'm not going to be able, since I'm only getting five dollars, to color in another one. But yeah, I just wanted to show you guys again that I made this and I love it so much. And <laughs> it's um, for our trip to Universal Studios in Orlando, Florida. And our goal is $6,000. So each of the little guys is 240 of the 25 shapes on here. How about we get the money? <laughs> Alrighty. Yeah, okay. Um, the sort quick is really helping me to actually grip this, I love it so much. Okay, 100, 200 are in the bank. Then we have 50, 60, 65, 70, 71, 72, 73, and 74, 274. We were hoping to go on this trip next year. Um, we'll see. I don't know if we're gonna be able to make that goal because we have other things that are a little bit higher priority right now and we've just barely been just trickling some money in here but you never know I think if we made it a higher priority we would reach that goal more quickly but if we had to go on small trips next year and make this big trip the next year I mean it wouldn't be the end of the world okay the welcome tablet fund this is for a digital art tablet that's like professional quality. Um, I don't need one technically right now. It's getting a dollar. Um, so yeah, I'm just slowly, slowly putting money into this each paycheck. My other one that I have works just fine. I have an XP pin. 20, 1, 2, and 3 is what's in there now after adding that dollar. Um, but yeah, I've always dreamt of having one of these tablets, so I'm going to save up for it. The mortgage fund. This quarter, every paycheck, I'm putting $30 in. So now we have 20, 40, 50, 60. getting close to time to um once these are all full erase it and start over so wow yeah I can't believe I've been using these this long these little trackers are from Jordan Budgets I won them in a giveaway along with the labels which are technically designed to be stickers but I um, laminated them because I love them so much and wanted to keep reusing them with different envelopes new fridge fund yay okay 
This one is getting 50 big ones today. <laughs> And I also have a savings challenge tracker for the fridge that I made that we will color in today, I hope. Alrighty, so for the new refrigerator, we have 500, 600, 700, 800 in the bank, 850, 870, 890, 95, 96. 97, 98, 99, $899. That's pretty that's oddly specific. The goal for the fridge is 1800, so we're getting there. We're $1 away from being halfway there, actually. Wow. While that dries, let's get our little fridge out. Yay. So each of these items is $90. So let's see. So there's 20 items total, each is $90. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. That would be 900 and we're $1 away. Oh, that's so sad. We don't get to color one in, but I do love this. This is actually available on my Etsy shop. Um, along with a few other coloring pages. It does not have to be just a savings challenge if you're a teacher or something like that. This could also be used as a coloring sheet. Um, yeah, I think it's for sale for $1 on my Etsy shop. So check it out. I will link it down below if you're interested, of course. Okay, so now that's probably dry. Our investment property is going to be getting $5. Twenty, thirty, thirty-five, forty, forty-five is what we have in here currently. I'm not sure what we want to invest in, but when I get this up to 100, I know for sure I'm going to go put it in a high yield savings account so that it can be accruing interest. I would like to do that actually sooner. Maybe I'll do it when it gets 50, like next month, because high yield savings accounts are like 2.2%, some of them on the interest right now, and that's phenomenal. Um, because my current savings account that I'm using is like 0.1% interest is absurdly low. The washer dryer fund is getting a dollar. Our washer and dryer um, is actually doing great now. We reorganized our laundry room and I love the new layout so much better. Oh my gosh, it's so much more efficient. I'm like, we don't even need a new washer and dryer unless these give out. But I want to be prepared in case that happens because earlier this year I know I had been talking about how I really wanted one because we were going to renovate the laundry room to be a cat room and now that we have basically just moved everything around gotten longer hoses and cords for the room um we actually don't even need to get smaller units we can go ahead and make it into a little cat room because there's more space in the room as it's organized now so super exciting all righty that means we now have 20, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38 dollars in the washer dryer fund. I have a, a savings challenge tracker um, behind this from Jordan Budgets, but each of these is 67 dollars, so we do not have enough for that just yet. Bedroom furniture, also kind of a lower priority right now. It's also only going to be getting a dollar. But eventually we're gonna want new bedroom furniture and I wanna be able to have a fund and not just be like, where are we, where are we gonna come up with the money for bedroon furniture? Here it is. <laughs> so now it has 20, one, two, and three dollars. Okay, home security, it is getting $50 today. And then at the end of the month, whenever or whenever I do my bill exchange, I'm going to take out 
this money and take it back to the bank. I'm probably using it for my bill exchange too because it's 50. So 50, 100, 102, one, wait, 101, 102. <laughs> $102, which I will take 100 of that out when I do my bill exchange to reimburse myself for buying the cameras. But for right now, we're just going to put plus 50, 102 in the envelope. Then, uh, last but not least, back here in our actual sinking funds, Veterinary is going to be getting five. The goal for this is to save up $150 for next year for my cats to have their yearly shots. So we have $20, 30 35 and $40 currently in this. We will definitely have that saved up by next year. Okay, and in the back here we have this. Let me get out the red vis a vis to color. Excuse me. And the envelope itself is getting 110. So let's see. Fifty, one hundred and ten. So th that means we have fifty, one hundred, fifty, sixty, sixty five, sixty six, sixty seven, sixty eight. Excellent. One hundred and sixty eight total. So we need to go through here and color some in. That's one hundred and ten more, which I might need my calculator for this. Let's just pick some of the biggest numbers there are that we can add up to this amount. <laughs> How about we do these two for a 30? And then doing these two for 30. And these two for 20. That leaves us with 30 more. Let's see. Ah, these two would make 30. Fun, okay. So I don't I know we're not gonna get all 500 of this. In fact, we might call this good and I might take out a hundred of this to pay myself back for the money that I spent at Spirit Halloween in Amazon. But this was a fun way to save up for a little Halloween get together, I think. And that is all of my sinking funds today. Let me try this. Excellent. So yes. Thank you all for joining me today. Do not miss my next video, which is going to be my cash shipping my 100 envelope um, savings challenge with the money that's up here. And then I also am going to be having a game day um, video coming out soon for this October month. I do one of those each month and a bill exchange as well. So lots of content coming y'all's way. And uh, don't forget to say hi to Larry. <laughs> so yes, everyone have a great day. Thanks for joining me again. And uh, we'll see you next time. Oh, don't forget to like the video and give me a comment if you'd like to. Bye.